What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Nazir here. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Kadri underscore underscore. That's K-H-A-D-R-I two underscores. Now, today I'm going to teach you guys how to get music in your YouTube videos without getting hit by YouTube with that copyright and fragment notice because I know that can be very obnoxious. Now, you get these copyright and fragment notices from YouTube because there's a whole bunch of legal issues that go inside of music and stuff and people who owns it. Now, if you want to learn more stuff about the uh, legal matters of using music in your videos and projects and things like that, uh, go check out Shameless Maya's channel. Now, she actually inspired me to make this video. Now, on her video, she actually has a person who actually guides uh, her viewers on how to uh, like use uh, music in your videos to make sure that uh, you want everything legally because the guy knows a lot about music and things like that but I can't really explain it uh, yeah go check out her channel Shameless Maya uh, uh, for all the legal matters and stuff for uh, you know, all that music and jazz now let's get started our YouTube so the first way how to get free music without getting hit by that copyright and back to notice is SoundCloud now SoundCloud has a whole bunch of music by uh, a whole bunch of uh, artists and composers who don't have record deals and things like that and probably don't have a uh, copyright on their music. Now you want to ask people if you can use their music on your videos because most likely you're using YouTube to get paid and your videos are monetized. Now, since you're making money off of their music, you just might want to uh, uh, contact the artist or uh, composer on whether or not you can use their music. Uh, but normally, it isn't really a problem, if, especially if it has the little download icon on SoundCloud. Now, that's why I get most of my music from. Uh, let's get to the next thing. Another place where you can get music is YouTube. Now, YouTube is uh, filled with a whole bunch of music also. Uh, it has a whole bunch of dope beats. I found a lot of dope beats that I use in my videos personally. And YouTube has a whole bunch of things like, uh, not a whole bunch of things, but a whole bunch of channels that have a whole bunch of music that you could download and use in your videos. Now, one I know is uh, MG... Uh, M yeah, MJ, MJ. Uh, now he makes uh, music and stuff. I used it in uh, a couple of my videos. I think I used it in my uh, following my dreams video. And also, LA Chase makes some nice music too on YouTube. Now those are just a couple places for uh, music for some dope beats. If you wanna go check them out, go check them out. Uh, I probably uh, butchered their channel name, but I'm gonna leave everybody and everything I mentioned down below in the description. All right, so the third thing that I think is really helpful is using mixtapes. Now mixtapes, you could get a mixtape from one of your favorite artists like J. Cole, Drake, anybody basically, Ashton, Robinson, Lil Wayne. Now the thing about mixtapes is that they are meant to be free for the audience. There are, are no copyright, or at least there shouldn't be any copyright uh, on any of their music tracks when you get a mixtape. Now, mixtape is filled with a whole bunch of dope things from your favorite artists. Now, who like uh, doesn't like that? So, I always use that. Well, not always. I sometimes use it in my uh, videos. Uh, Action Bronx, and I used it in my uh, Air Max 90 video. Um, but yeah, mixtapes is also a great thing to use like when you want to uh, get uh, music in your videos. Uh, yeah, it's been a while since I did these videos. Let's go! Bro, bars for days, mixtape coming soon. Hey, last but not least is people like people that you know. If you know a friend that makes music, uh, like makes music, like sings, raps, or who is a composer who makes beats, use their stuff because most likely they're going to let you, especially if they're your friend. Uh, they shouldn't be asking you for money because, like, I just doubt they'll do that. Um, but yeah, friend, I use my uh, aunt's, husband, brother's music in my uh, videos 
Um, I use his stuff in a couple of my videos, and uh, I also use my cousin's uh, music. He makes uh, beats and stuff. I also use his in my videos. Now, uh, yeah, that's just about it. Uh, SoundCloud, YouTube, mixtapes, and people basically. Uh, there are other sites out there like for royalty free music and things like that. But if you really want to learn about all of the other sites and stuff for royalty free music, please go check out Shameless Maya's uh, channel. I don't even know her, but her channel is pretty dope. Go check her out, Shameless Maya. Alright, so that's basically about it SoundCloud, YouTube, mixtapes, and people. So, yeah, uh, that's basically it. Uh, share this information with anybody who may need it. Uh, and if you have any questions about this video, just go in the damn bar below and type up. And also, one more thing, uh, I'm starting this new thing where you could hit me up on Twitter or, uh, or just the section down below for comments. Uh, if you have a question, I will answer it to the best of my ability. Now... Uh, yeah, just, and use the hashtag X Nazir. Put that on Twitter or just comment down below, and I'll answer the questions to the best of my ability once again. I know I'm going, going, but anyways, I'm about to be out. I'm sweating once again. Instagram, and Twitter is Kadri underscore underscore. That's K J B R I two underscores. And comment, subscribe, share with your friends. Deuces.